And we are here. We've got more actual color and culture this time. We're talking literal art with Mr. Henry Watson. Now, Mr. Watson is from Lavonia, Louisiana, and for the last 40 plus years, he's been making one of a kind artwork from former pieces of cypress wood. Thank you so much for joining us on Love I'm happy to be here. Thank you very much for inviting me. So first, tell me exactly how did you get into this recreation of the cypress wood into masterpieces? It all started many, many years ago from a little area called Lavonia, Louisiana. I attended Lavonia High School in our art department. Mr. Alan Crochet taught us the three-dimensional of wood carving. And the wood of choice was cypress. Cypress because it was all around us. And you know, when someone say they got cypress wood, they talk about wood eternal. Cypress lasts forever. That's right. It can last yes. in water and everything. And now yes. you're taking a lot of these pieces and this cypress's wood is so Louisiana and you're turning them into pictures of Louisiana, right? Absolutely. I take this cypress from old torn down buildings and cabins because it told a story. You take an old cabin that was built 100 years ago out of this cypress. I take a picture of the cabin, get the wood, and recreate it in the cypress wood. Okay, so let's see one of them. Show me one of these. What is this one? So this is a plantation this here. This is Paul Orange Plantation. The story behind Paul Orange go way back. I was 15 years old. I met the Lucy Paul Orange. She told me, you continue doing what you do, the world will be the path to your dough. Forty-some years later, literally from the world, they come to my dough. Right, we were talking on the phone and you told me that people take um, a cruise ship and they stop in New yes, Rose and you yes. show them some of your artwork. So people from all over the world are stopping in to buy from some of your art. From all over the world. And the wonderful thing about that is the America Queen is coming to New Rose and I'm the star people there and I demonstrate the art of 3D carving to all of the passengers. They come back and order a picture of their home, I make it and ship it. Now this is going round, round, round all the time. And with, just since you walked into this, to the News 2 studio, we've had people who've purchased your artwork before. Yes. So if, is it going to break my bank if I wanted to buy it's one of your artwork, It's never going to break Watson? your bank. Some like good things, you have to prepare for it. So <laughs> it's a Watson could be had by anyone. That's right. If you want a Watson. And you make yeah. custom pieces. So show me one of those custom pieces actually features Baton Rouge's USS Kid. Absolutely. Mr. Tom Hanks came and shot the movie uh, The Greyhound. I decided that I would do a carving of his movie set that was shot in Baton Rouge. What a wonderful statement. And he was supposed to come back to Baton Rouge and do his opening, and what happened, he caught COVID. So yeah. this is the piece that I created for the Tom Hanks to see. Tom Hanks is secretly a good friend of WBRC. Gave us a big time shout out when he was on the USS Kid Wonderful. shooting Greyhound. Yes, so yes. this is amazing stuff. You're taking old cypress wood, 100 year old cypress wood, yes. and turning them into absolute masterpieces. So what would you say about your art? If you had to describe it in just a few words, how would you describe it? Well, I tell people I capture their story, the memories of the days gone by. Think about these old boards. These old boards were once part of a wall and now it's the Watson is hanging on your wall. And if you had to guess, how many people, are, how many pieces of your work are out there in the world hanging on someone's oh, wall? Oh gracious, that would be tough to decide because I've done them for 40 some years and I never kept count. Now we are documenting every piece that goes out the door. Okay. So literally it's thousands and thousands of Watsons somewhere. Well, thank you yeah. so much for contributing your art here. and your heart and just contributing to our culture down here in South Louisiana. And we love 225, so we love that you are contributing in this major way. And it's a wonderful place to be, 225. All right, thank, thank you, you so much, Mr. Watson.